What's up photographers? In this video, I'm gonna show you a really cool SEO trick for 2023 where you're gonna leverage ChatGPT and basically have this do work that would otherwise take you multiple hours or even days. And if you procrastinate like me and like a lot of other photographers, you might not ever get done. So what I'm gonna have you do is go to Keyword Planner. And I'm just using this as an example. I'll probably even give her this blog that I'm gonna make. Um, but uh, you're gonna come into your Google Ads, come into Keyword Planner tool, and you're gonna type in a keyword that you're trying to rank for, and you can put your website in there, that way it like helps you find only relevant uh, search terms. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna type that in, and you're gonna get a result, and you can either start going down and looking for different topics to write, maybe long tail keywords that have low competition and have high amounts of average searches. And you can see here, obviously, you know, our homepage and um, a lot of the service pages are already rank uh, ranking for these and we're already competing for these. Um, but we might want to start targeting some of these. And one really good way to look at this is not only the average monthly searches, but also the year over year change. And you can see some of these are dropping off, have very low monthly searches. Um, and then let's go over here. Unique boudoir photo shoot. Okay. So unique boudoir photo shoot, let's use that. It's got a decent amount of monthly searches. It's a long tail keyword. It shows a lot of intent, low competition, and then year over year change. The other thing I can look at too is three month change and just see, uh, is there anything that stands out? Celebration, boudoir photography, maybe those are kind of like brand names, certified professional. Nope, not a lot of search volume on that couples. Maybe that maybe we'll do that next. So what you can do is you come into ChatGPT and we are going to prompt it to write a blog for us. And what's great about ChatGPT is like the more info you give it, the better. And you can talk to it like you would an assistant. One thing I like to do since I don't like typing, although I have a cool keyboard from ASIO uh, that's like mechanical, makes really good sound, but like um, whatever. Uh, for whatever reason, I use the dictation tool and I just went into... Um, my settings and I set dictation to control twice and I can do this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell it that we need to write a blog for this. Okay. I own a boudoir studio called Liberation Boudoir in Miami, Florida. I own an Apple Watch. The hell? A boudoir studio called Liberation Boudoir in Miami, Florida. You're going to help me write a blog of at least a thousand words on the topic. Do you understand? And it should return yes. Please provide me more details. Okay. Then I'm going to come over here. And let's think about... Um, first, let's brainstorm five to ten... Uh, unique photo shoot ideas. Ones that I can think of right now are couples boudoir, black and white. Uh, let's just say like mm, angel, angel wings, white sheets. Let's think what else. Um, nude, let's do bondage, maybe something like that. Let's do, um, yeah, and bondage, maybe, well, maybe not. What is that even called? I don't know what the word is for that kind of like BDSM. Um, but let's see what style, sh let's make it relevant to this. Um, let's make it like, hmm. Let me actually go to her website and see what else. Because obviously I don't want to like promote something that you know I might not, she might not do, but black and white. Ooh, bridal. Bridal. Boudoir. Uh, okay. First, let's brainstorm. Here are five unique photo shoots, lingerie and high heels. Okay. Vintage glamour, it's pretty cool. Beach boudoir. She doesn't really do on location. 
so let's just say like don't do on location so please remove beach and cityscape and include some of the ideas I had okay couples boudoir black and white okay white sheets I like spiral boudoir <clears throat> okay fine art Ooh, pinup. Almost forgot about pinup. See, this is good. It's already included pinup. All right. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna say these are great ideas. Um, these are great ideas. Create an in a witty intro about how the person reading the blog might be interested in a boudoir photo shoot, but they might not know exactly what to do or they don't want it to be boring. It to be boring. Man, I don't know why this thing doesn't understand me. It usually does. A boring um, blog will cover unique ideas to, you know, create an amazing shoot. And then at the end of the blog, add a call to action where they can contact the studio in order to book their own session. Incorporate ideas how these photos can be used to make a photo album, prints, and other products. Um, and expand and give a lot more detail for every single unique idea. Okay. And by the way, back in the day, I remember you used to have to go to like a photography like blog writer and pay forty, fifty dollars for them to send you something like this back because a lot of times, like maybe they weren't super versed on it, and you would kind of give them an idea, give them some of your thoughts, and yeah. And you know, to get even 300 words was maybe $30 and 500 words was 50 and a oh, thousand words was like a hundred dollars. So this is a pretty badass idea. And then all you would have to do is maybe create some internal links um, and then, you know, add some images, uh, name your alt text. Um, and you can even ask it. You could say, hey, um, I, I have to n name my images. Give me, uh, image names or alt text to write uh, in order to rank for this. And one other thing we can do is if you wanted to, you could feed it keywords. So like, um, let's optimize this for SEO. So let's see if that, that'll work. Keep in mind, in Miami and service South, all of South Florida, make sure to include location keywords as boudoir photographer. Okay. And obviously like, you know, she probably doesn't do all of these. Our pinup photo shoot is perfect for clients. And let's see. Um, right now, the Paragraphs are too short. Um, please write three to five sentences for each photo shoot idea. And then let's see. In Miami, Florida, you can see it's like in putting those keywords in there. Okay, let's see. And of course, like obviously I'm just doing this as a mock-up. So like, you, you know, you probably maybe have some bullet points and I would just use those. That way it doesn't like make them up. Because if I hand this over to somebody, because I'm not doing this for myself, they would be like, well, I don't even do fantasy. I've never done pain. I don't have images of that, you know? So maybe they have shower scenes. Maybe they have, 
you know, erotica. Maybe they have, um, you know, LGBTQ, like whatever the case is. So, yeah. For brides to be. All right. Well, that's basically it. Obviously, like depending on what website you're on, uh, you know, you're going to go in and copy and paste this, add, you know, heading, table contents, you know, create links internally, externally, you know, page description, page title, and you can probably prompt ChatGPT to do a lot of this. And just remember, the more information you give it, the more precise you are, the better the output's going to be for you. So yeah, really good way to create content for your blog and possibly rank on Google for some of these long tail keywords to get more traffic to your website. Um, well, by the way, if you're just watching this video, I'm Humberto Garcia. I own Photography to Profits. And if you want to see how we can manage your paid ads so that you don't have to rely on SEO, rely on content, because by the way, even if you publish this, this might take months or even weeks to start you know, showing up on some of these top pages, depending on you know the competition, your backlinks, and um, et cetera. So I highly encourage you, if you want to jumpstart, we work with studios that typically you know are in the 25 to 100,000 dollars a month range um but if you're not there and you know you're going to be your work's very competent um you know hopefully we can see if we can help you in your city and I'll show you exactly what we do behind the scenes so um 